down towards the last furlong. No risk how more it is now. Who's two lengths ahead of in second place? Candado Falga. All the time Munif is staying on. No risk how more with Richard Hill down in front by a length and a half. And no risk how more goes on to win. They head down with a furlong marker in sight. Jaffa ASF in front, but now no risk. Almori comes through on the stand side to take it up as they approach the final furlong. And it's no risk. Almori who goes on by about a half length. Jaffa ASF is fighting back strongly on the far side as they head towards the line. No risk. Almori has it by about a length and wins it for the second time. No risk. Almori hit the front 300 metres out. Race to length and a half clear. Santhel going to second. Then Kanda Dufel gas followed by Pete Royale. It's no risk El Mori in front. 150 metres left to go. Santhel is trying hard to come after no risk El Mori. No risk El Mori in front. He's hard ridden close to home. And no risk El Mori goes into the history books. And no risk, Almori charged to the lead. Past the 300 metres mark, Candidou Felgas goes to second. Paola Pal on the outside battling on, then Paris Gagné, but it's no risk, Almori in front. 120 metres left to go. Richard Hills is riding him hard. Candidou Felgas can't eat into the ground, and no risk, Almori will be too good. No risk, Almori wins the third round like he did the first. 300 metres out and no risk El Mori takes the lead. First away from Frivolous running to second. Then Zell Fred, Nerwad, Candidou Felgas, Samo King on the outside. But the clock is turned back 12 months. No risk El Mori in front. He's well clear of Frivolous. He's streaking to the line and no risk El Mori wins the first. to chase Majani. Majani has to dig. Char the Greys after him, but Danny and Char. Char on the inside. Majani's fighting back. He's pulled out all of his champion class and Majani has won his third Gahela Classic. Johnny has taken the lead, but Johnny travelling well through two lengths in front. And Mr. Roy second is under the whip. Alawal holding down third, and then a break to Hazard of Faust at the 300 metres peg, and Bajani in front. Van Nisselroy out of the centre of the track is giving chase, but it's a lane chase. Bajani well clear, 150 metres left to run, hard against the running rail. Richard Hills keeping him going, has a look over his shoulder, and Bajani is a mile in front of Van Nisselroy who's being eased. Last 
past the quarter, Bola Majani, more than a length in front. Kender Dufal Gas is under the whip. Then Royal Epic, Almuda Wakel battling away. Paris Gagnier can do no more. Majani in front at the 200 metres mark. Kander Dufal Gas is trying. Almuda Wakel third. Privatus on the outside. Majani's clear. 50 metres left to go. He's holding Kander Dufal Gas and Majani is back in the winner's circle at Nat Al Shiva. Saoudi à la corde, temps de se défendre, défendre de Sadjela avec également à l'extérieur un beau retour du numéro 12 de Sadjela aux abords du poteau, c'est le 3 Al Saoudi qui s'impose à la deuxième place pour le... Le numéro 1 qui se rapproche avec David Michaud. Euh, les concurrents sont sur toute la largeur avec Musharab à l'extérieur qui vient maintenant attaquer son compagnon euh, de Kazakh Razik. Mais Al Shaïm est bien reparti le long de la corde. Al Shaïm, le numéro 2 qui a l'avantage. Al Shaïm aux abords du poteau devant le numéro 4. Ah oui, qui a toujours l'avantage. Détaché de Wassel en deuxième position. Odax qui vient à l'extérieur. Zarouk de mieux en mieux à l'extérieur. Kazakh jaune avec la top noire. Alzac B qui plonge à la corde également, qui regagne énormément de terrain. Alzac B à la lutte avec El Raoui devant Wassel. Avec Odax à l'extérieur aux abords du poteau. Alzac B, El Raoui. El Raoui, Alzac B, El Raoui aux abords du poteau. 150 meters from home and with giant strides to the line. It's Vulcan Duclos on the outside under David Morrison. The Royal Stable Colors of Oman are winning the president of the UAE Cup in a glamorous style. Vulcan Duclos wins it. Kaolino led 350 meters left to go. It's Kaolino a length in front. Bob Moon trying to close the gap. Jayush out in the center of the track putting in a surge. Kaolino led at the 200 meters mark. He's got some petrol left in the locker. Kaolino had burst four lengths in front. Dayush runs to second, then Bob Moon and Van Nisselrooy, but it's Kaolino and Richard Hills in front. Kaolino is too good, and Kaolino wins the Kahala Classic.